right now on Fox 35 News at 10. This cabinet would had all my uh, wedding gifts and my wife's wedding gifts silver in it. New tonight at 10, honors stolen from a Central Florida veteran who served in several battles. Tonight, the search for the heartless crook who ripped him off. The 80 year old man visiting his family out of state when somebody broke in and just ransacked the home. And it's not the first time that home has been targeted by thieves either. Holly Bristow live in the newsroom with more on this top story. Holly. Sunny, this is such a heartbreaking story. This 80 year old man hasn't been broken into once, not twice, but three times since last June. Walking around his home, 80 year old Lee Smith is still in shock. There's nothing left for him to take. For the third time in less than 12 months, he returned from a trip to find someone had ransacked his home. How did you feel when you realized you'd been broken into again? Pretty bad. The first time thieves forced their way in, Smith was at Arlington National Cemetery burying his wife. The second time, he was away at his sister's funeral. This time, he was visiting his daughter and her family. They chiseled his lockout. This time they went from room to room and took some irreplaceable mementos. They were sitting right here. The medals and the ribbon bar. Medals and ribbons Smith earned serving in the Navy during Vietnam and the Korean Wars. They had a lot of meaning to me. Maybe not somebody else, but to me they had a lot of meaning. What did they mean to you? Well, they meant 21 years of service is what they meant. And I loved the service. And that's not all. This cabinet would, had all my uh, wedding gifts and my wife's wedding gift silver in it. Now these shelves sit empty. The 52 year old sterling silver serving where he wanted to pass down to his kids gone and likely gone for good. According to the officers, she couldn't find prints, so they had to wear gloves. Thieves also got the $2,000 three wheeled scooter he uses to help him get around a flat screen computer monitor and dozens of DVDs and movies. Why would anybody want VHS tapes? The only reason Smith still has his TV and his laptop he took those with him. I've replaced them twice now. Wow. And that's hard on the pocketbook. But he'd yeah. gladly trade his electronics for his silver and his metals. Oh, the sentimental value is more than the value of it. Mr. Smith wonders if thieves knew that he was out of town because of uh, pictures that he had posted on social media showing that he was fishing with his family up in the panhandle. I helped him change some of the settings on his phone so only his friends will be able to see his posts from now on. Bob.